Oh my god, what? are you gonna ask? <laughs> do you wanna do something? Like a, a date? You're joking! Me. Oh, no! You wanna uh, go do something? You shouldn't be having to do this on your own, Billy. Is there new news from your dad? Tyler started it. I was just defending myself. What's that sound? Ah, it's a tiny violin. Never your fault, is it? Kids like you. Kids like me what? No phones in detention. No, no, but sir, my sister. Had enough of your excuses, Hopkins. It's the same thing every single week. Get in there. Right, you've all got your work. Do it. Can I quickly use my phone? Because me and my mum have plans and she gets worried. She's been told you're here. You can call her in an hour. Until then, I don't want to hear a peep from this room. Got it? My numbers were out, so I did a bit of digging. You can see here that Billy and Rihanna Hopkins were both in credit last week, but then mm -hmm. if you go into the payments section, the last deposit from Mr Hopkins was right at the start of term. This recent credit on their accounts come from nowhere. They're clearly fiddling the system. Do you seriously think they'll do that? Well, how else do you explain it? Just thought you'd like to know. Billy Hopkins is in detention again, along with Darcy Trent and Summer Bailey. That's half the members of your one-man rehabilitation crusade, isn't it? I never said it was gonna be a smooth ride. What did Billy do this time? Usual. Mouthing off at another kid. The boy's like a coiled spring. Let me get IT onto this, okay? We can't go throwing around accusations when it may just be a computer glitch. Thanks for letting me know. Got something to say? Private joke. I don't waste my time talking about losers. Yeah? Well, winning don't count when you do it by cheating. Meaning? What's he all about? Don't know. Don't care. What are you lot doing here? We saw grinding on the joke inside. Like I've you already made up my mind anyway. Oh, shut up! Are you allowed to say that to us, Miss? Isn't that abuse? Well, I don't want to hear your excuses. But they're not excuses. Yes, they are. You sound like a bunch of whiny brats. Don't you get it yet? You need to be showing your best, not your worst. Otherwise, you'll be proving the haters right. Right? OK, 
cow. What's happening? Thank you. Venus. No, I've got to be somewhere. What? Your new mate? Just leave me alone. It's a free country. Earth. Mars. Jupiter. I know I know regular updates about everything, especially that Mina. She's desperate for my part. Like she has any star quality, I'll text you. Um, I don't think so. Thank you, Layla. You can spend this time focusing on the technology questions you failed to complete earlier. Ronnie, shouldn't you be in rehearsals now? Yes, miss. I was just going. Sit up straight. And no slouching. Get on with it. <laughs> Why are you in detention? Why do you care? I, I know I ain't been around much, but... It doesn't matter. Anyways, I'm busy with the musical. You know I've got to make time for Billy. You get so moody when he doesn't go to see me. Why can't you just sit down? Bed books? Wanna stop doing that? Or what? You'll get your butler on me. Ouch. Jealousy is really burning you up. What was you meant to do with your mum? Pamper session. This idea of mother daughter bonding and should have left thousands of messages and hate to when I don't reply. Yeah. I, I could do with my phone as well. Rihanna's not well. I should be checking on her. I'll go to the staff room and get your phone. Yours too. You'll have detentions for a month if Edwards catches you. So? You need your phone, don't you? No, you're going nowhere near my phone. I'll go. Yeah, how about we all go? Up straight, no slouching. <laughs> so come on, what'd you do? Kept making fart sounds every time Abel sat down. Loudly. Not you as well. Are you ever on time? What did you do? No, I was, uh, he was... Are we going or did you bottle it? No, it's Nathan. No one's there. And anyway, we're here. Why do you want to leave detention anyway? But what if you get caught? Sure. You come in. I see you here on the street I hear you cry Got nothing to eat So let's stand together Let's all stand that tall That look amazing the gap between the rich and the poor Anyone can slap on a bit of paint No they can't It's a real talent I didn't know you were into drama I do all the clubs Art, chess, debate team Japanese. That way you can find out what you like, right? You meet so many new people. I see you here walking the street. I hear you cry, got nothing to eat. So let's stand together, let's all stand tall. I need let's some air. There's a gap between the rich and the poor. So let's stand together, let's all stand tall. Let's bridge the gap between the rich and the poor.
And then I shoved a banana in the exhaust pipe of Abel's car. <laughs> Her face when she started the engine. Oh. That's, that's why you got detention every day for a week. Yep. I remember Mum's face when she brought you from school. She was so mad. Never needed much of an excuse to get angry with me. There's your mates, isn't it? I'll cover if Abel comes back. Don't be long. Why are you still here, Nathan? Wait for a friend, sir. Pretty sure that everyone's left. Go on. Becky! Hey! Hey! You got a minute? Yeah. I need to pick your brain. You were Billy's mentor at the Prue, right? Yeah. I'm getting bad reviews from some staff. Let me guess. Tampa like a raging bull. You got any inside info that might help? Well, trust is massive for Billy. He's a tough kid. Once he feels he can trust you a little, he'll open up. A little. But yeah? He's been through a lot. But it do not get worse than losing your mum. And whenever we felt we reached a breakthrough, something else would happen, and it's two, three, ten steps back. It just doesn't seem to catch a break. But this place could make a real difference to him. Thanks. Too, right? One well, promising I can zip in text by now. The edges could be anywhere. Someone dodged a bullet last week. In a wicked time. She tell you. You're a joke. What is it your dad does again? Oh, it's definitely something minimum wage. You know, someone's smart. She can see you'll always be a loser like him. I know you locked me in that point of room. There you go again blaming other people. You know what I think? No! And I don't care either. I think it was what you call it. Self sabotage. Because deep down, you know you're not good enough for summer. You never will be. Billy! I, I wasn't. He was asking for it. To get smacked in the face? Listen! Oh, quick! On the way. Told you I'd get us in here. Let me look at that. <laughs> You're the one who got us in here. Not him. You're the hero. Five minutes max, right? We don't want to get caught in here.
I want more than this. I feel for my people there's more than this and I'm sure of it. I will fight till we're given much more than this. I want more than this. I feel for my people there's more than this and I'm Can you hear the bell? Home time. Yeah, but... No buts. Run along. If you're so desperate to be here, I can put you in detention. What is it with you and your sister? It's weird. Do you want a black eye to go with that busted nose? Must have touched a nerve. At least I don't have to lock people in rooms to get a date. What did you say? It's nothing. It's Billy Boy's dry excuse for last week's no-show. He shot me in the boiler room. Not true. That's why you weren't there. Yeah. Anyone know what this thing does? I think it plays music. <laughs> what is that? Are you trying to get us caught? Yeah, because that would make so much sense. You should hear yourself. As if anyone could hear themselves over you. Carry on, I'll smack you back. Yeah, try it. Shut up, you two. I can't have a look at this. Is this from the day we got locked in the boiler room? Look. I did say. Great. I've lost Edwards. Can we please get out of here now? You can. I say we have some fun. Anyway, we'll catch up. Hey, Rihanna, how are you? Uh, fine, sir. Is your dad in by any chance? He's um, he's gone to the corner shop for tea bags. Right. I heard you went well today. How are you now? Oh yeah, it's this blood sugar thing. I'm um, hypo allergenic. You mean hyperglycemic? Got to. It's no biggie. Good. And you've settled in okay at Phoenix Rose? Because you would tell me if there was any problems. Honestly, we love it. The teachers, more like friends, they totally get us. Okay. Great. It, do you want to wait inside? I'm sure that won't be long. No. I should go. Please just let them know that I passed by, yeah?
Need to get out of here now. Miss Abel's coming. She's gonna go ballistic. What do you think? We need to get out of here now. Phones! It's too late. Can we jump out of the window? We ain't got much time. It's a bit high up for Darcy. And it's locked anyway. Maybe we can hide. Where? In the fridge? Well, I don't see you coming up with any better ideas. I was the one they said we should go. Because you're a fun sponge. This isn't solving anything. She'll be here any second. I'll go and distract her. Then you lot can get out. No way. Getting caught don't bother me. I want out of this place anyway. OK. Nice knowing you, Darce. No. We're in this together. If one of us goes down, we all go down. Ready? <laughs> what was that? What on earth is the matter, Ronnie? Uh, yes? Um. Yes? I really need your help, Miss Abel. I'm in big trouble. What is it? Well, what's wrong? How do I get the paint out, miss? My mum's gonna kill me. I I'm sure she'll understand. No. Um, no. Stains are really, uh, offensive in my culture. <laughs> you have to help me. OK. And now we're flies. And we gon' kick it this time, cause you know it's a vibe. Let the music get up in your mind and take you high. Let the music get up in your mind and take you high. Yes, sir. We're never gonna get back before Edward. Oh, we will. This is the quickest way. No, we should have gone through the canteen. Do you two ever stop? Right, let's see how he got on. Book plays. This is all correct. Goes to show what you're capable of when you engage that brain of yours. The next time, spare me the illustrations. I just saw you. You were out there. You must be mistaken, sir. I haven't left this room. What happened to your face? Fell over. From your chair? In here? Yeah. This room is a health and safety nightmare. You really should look into it. Well. The school's CCTV will give me all the answers, I'm sure. Can we have our phones back now, sir? I don't remember sending you here. Miss Abel brought him after you left, sir. You gonna be okay with your mum? I'm just glad I forgot my homework. Got me out of our bonding session. It's not like you to forget stuff. I don't know what you're implying. You must be gutted. Didn't manage to get yourself kicked out. 
Looks like you'll be stuck with us a little bit longer. I guess so. You lot so owe me. Uh, I know, I know, I know. The life's over, Ronnie. It's a crazy. <laughs> 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 Them man there, them man there, ain't nothing like them man there. My man, I stand up, give them man chairs. Them man there, them man there, gonna warm to them man there. Rule one of my circle, them man squares. Them man there, them man there, gonna warm to them man there. Rule one of my circle. Please stop overreacting. Shh. I think it's normal. I know it is. The only thing abnormal around here is you. Have you eaten anything today? No, because you forgot to buy bread. Yeah. Sorry. Here. I got chocolate. Oh! Mr Stewart was here before. What? He came to talk to Dad. And what did you tell him? Stop panicking. I'm not stupid. He said he popped to the shop. You didn't let him in? No, of course not. I think he just wanted to know how we're getting on at school. Don't worry, everything's cool. Mr. Samarski, how you doing? Oh, Mr. Stewart. I was just wondering, Billy Hopkins, when did his dad last come in? Hi, it's Summer from Phoenix Rise. I've popped in to tell you that you can watch all episodes of Phoenix Rise on BBC iPlayer anytime and any way you like. Just search for Phoenix Rise and BBC iPlayer.